Hello, Miguel from Grumo here, and QuizUp has already seven new updates. It's only been three days since I released it, and now it has seven new awesome updates. Now you can sell your quizzes. How cool is that? You can put a price to them and sell them. You can apply discounts, so you can motivate people to take action, play a discount coupon. You can enforce time limits to make sure people don't spend hours taking your the quizzes and they have a rush, they feel rushed to take the quiz and, and do very good. And you can restrict the maximum attempts so they don't get to try infinite times the same quiz. You can also accept written responses. So until now your questions only could be multiple choice, but now you can do a mix of multiple choice and written questions. How cool is that? Then you can monitor all your written questions and grade them individually. And finally, there is a sales dashboard where you can track all your yourselves. Now let me show you how all these features work. So to sell your quizzes, just select any quiz, then click on the edit button and set a price, in this case $49, and then click done, and the start quiz button becomes a buy button, and now your students can buy the quiz. If you want to allow discount coupons, just click on edit, click on enable coupons, enter the coupon name, the discount, the quantity, and a expiry date on the future, and now the coupon field appears, you can enter a coupon, apply the coupon, there's a discount applied, and now the students can buy the quiz. You can enter a credit card number on the future, and enter your name, and then you can place the order, click done, and now this will change into the start quiz button once the transaction goes through. And there you go. Now we can start taking the quiz. Start quiz and then answer the multiple choice questions and then you will get a score at the end. How cool is that? Now if we go back, I'm gonna show you a couple of new features. The first one is that you can limit the attempts that students can take. Let's say 10 attempts here and the time that they have allowed to complete the quiz. Let's say one minute. And when we click done, we'll see that now we have two new fields telling us how many attempts left we have and what's our time limit and we can retake the quiz and we'll see a countdown timer and once we finish the quiz and we will go back we can see that the attempt count went down from nine to eight. The next really cool feature is that now you can accept written responses on top of multiple choice questions. So if you go here and edit the quiz we can click on any question and we can change the question to accept written response and when we go back and we click done and we retake the quiz, that question instead of multiple choice has become a written response question. We can enter here our response and then we can finish our quiz, but we don't get the final score because there's at least one question that needs to be manually graded. Now, if you're logged in as the administrator, you'll be able to manually grade the written responses. Let's say that this question was correct. And now when we go back, we can see that we get the score. If there are a lot of people taking quizzes with written answers, you can see all the written answers under this sandwich menu on the top left corner. And then when you go to grade, you can see all the written answers that you could grade right from there. And you can say right or wrong or mark a spending. And that's how you do it. Finally, because you can accept sales right now, you probably wanna see a summary of all your sales. So if you go back to the administrator screen, you'll be able to see that on top of the existing stats, now we have two new fields, one for the sales count, number of sales, and then the total sales that you've accumulated over time. And then you can see a summary of the last few recent sales, and then you can click on the sale and see the details of the sale. And you can also see here the recent scores, and we can see that this score is not calculated because we still have an, an answer to be graded because it's a written answer and we say correct. Now that would now that would show us the final score for that quiz. And that's pretty much it. This is a pretty complete quiz taking app that you can get at grumo.com slash quiz app. Happy quizzing. Thanks for watching. Bye bye.